No more show late night. You know what it is, your boy D is nice. That's right, I'm the camera. We have just left the studio because we are out here in these streets. That's right. As New now. York reopens, we're getting back outside. We're gonna talk to our fellow New Yorkers to find out the post of the city. Talk about you know what's, what's bothering them. Oh what shit, going what's up with the picture? Oh shit, big Andrew the oh, no. oh, oh, shit. God. You know your man, famous face. You've seen him on so many viral clips. The originator to this man on the street stuff. You know Except saying? no imitations. How you doing, man? I'm doing fantastic. How you guys doing? Good. Well, we need you. We're gonna use you now. For what? We're we're gonna do man on the street. Us three we're back in there together. We're gonna do us it. three together. Let's do it. Let's go. Come on, we're gonna get on a dollar van right here. You know what I'm saying? Driver, driver! Most beautiful person last. We gotta get comfortable. We gotta get comfortable. We gotta make space because my auntie's getting off of work, so she's getting back. That's how real friends travel. So, hey, what have you been up to? Because we, you know, there was a controversy. You had your show. Yeah. Now you got your new show. I got fandangled out of my previous show. Okay. I got a new show called Channel Five. Mm -hmm. Okay. Instead of having an RV, I have a news van. Got you. You know what I mean? With fake satellites on it. Nice. I'm traversing the country once again. Doing different kinds of shit. <laughs> Are you on the Heem team? Bro, your shit is whack as fuck. Now, the style of Man on the Street, just the way you interview people, yeah. you feel like people have bitten. Hell yeah. Yeah. But at the same time, it's like, I don't want to be that like washed up old dude mm -hmm. who's on Instagram Live. Like, like an old rapper, like, yo, yeah, they stole yeah, my flow. Not doing, they're not doing Man on the Street like I did it. Yeah. I'm the first man on the first street. Yeah, they going in with tight jeans. I never do it like that. Like yeah, that kind of thing. Yeah, exactly. Do you have this a lot? Do people, when you put the camera in front of them, just like the lie? Well, the, the key about good interviewing, in my opinion, is don't be confrontational. Just listen as hard as you can. I'm about to take this balloon to the fucking neck and that's it. Why? <laughs> Just because I don't give a fuck about the authority and shit. That's weird because that's literally the opposite of how I do my interviews. Like, well, fuck I mean, the people we're interviewing. You guys are funny. I'm not okay. that funny. Okay. All right. <laughs> so you just kind of like lay lay it out for them, like, yo, what what are we doing here? The best question is, what's on your mind? Got gotcha. you. Oh, okay. Because okay. the person with something to say, it's sitting right there in the front of their brain. They're just ready to just spew out whatever the hell they're thinking. Got gotcha. you. Come on. As you see everywhere we go, cancel culture is taking out all the great ones. How do you stay off the radar of cancel culture? Don't say the N word. <laughs> Thank you. Very Thank you. So Thank many you. people fuck up. So it's people, so simple. Yeah. Some people put BLM in the bio, other people live it. Thank oh you. God damn. It's fucking raining, you guys. Yeah, yeah, it is, it's it is raining. It is raining. This is the tour we show New Yorkers. We just throw them in the van. Yo, and we're like, it's fucking raining. Yo, it's raining, yo. <laughs> yo, that's, that a dollar, right there, that's, that's a pizza, pizza. place, okay? Yo, if you look to your right, that's one of our famous New York institutions. It's called CVS Pharmacy. That's right. Yeah. How's my man riding the city bike in the rain not getting wet? Because he got things to do. Andrew, all right, intimate conditions. Right now, we are in the remnants of a tropical storm. Have you ever worked in conditions like this? I never have. OK. So true, see, true. we are immigrant kids, so like this kind of weather, like we still have to work. So yeah. you're, you are now an immigrant kid. You're joining us. Thank you. I appreciate it. Right, I've always go. wanted to become one. So. Exactly. Let's go. Today, we're, we're fulfilling so many fantasies. Thank you. We're pulling up to a location. Now, I believe we are going to Washington Square Park. Park. We're about to get wet for we're real. We're about to get wet we're for real. We're about to get wet for real. real. <laughs> see, I know we're going to stop down real quick. Yeah, yeah. Look at it. I mean, the park is pretty empty. They really are not turning off that fountain. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. It's like, what? What's the worst? The fountain's gonna get wet? It's yeah, water. Yeah. yeah. You want me to go outside and get wet to turn water off? How does that <laughs> make me look like a fucking jerk? God damn it, this fucking raining for real. No skateboarding, no bicycling, or no scooter riding. Nowhere on there does it say no masturbation. That's that's, I, I was just thinking that, yeah, you know? Yeah. Kind of lay a fucking towel down and just beat off for 45 minutes. You used to be able to do it in New York. You gotta break the stigma. Yeah. <laughs> People act like it's so disgusting. Oh shit, oh shit, the cops. I'm gonna fuck with you. <laughs> B uh, bastards, they hear me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you see me? I didn't give a fuck. You didn't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You give a fuck. But they, they're like, they're like jokes. Every, every time I see the pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Are we still trying to do this? When we first started, we was like, it's going to be whimsical. We're going to take Andrew to Washington Square Park. We are trapped here. We're trapped here. Um, we can't get out this van. We, can't. we got Tommy chilling in the back. Tommy's the man. Hey, Tommy, say what's up. What's <laughs> <laughs> Tommy's just, Tommy just chilling in the back. Actually, I do need to make a beer right? Oh, you need a beer? We got a beer. Tommy, we got a beer for you. Hey. It's the 18th hour. We've been waiting in this van for the weather to get better. You know what I'm saying? It's not getting better. We didn't bring any food. If you had to eat one of us, which one would you eat first? Obviously. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Would you guys eat human meat before you die? Yes. Yes. Which business do you feel like is Satan controlled? Like daycare centers. Which historical figure would you be most surprised to learn is in hell? Oh, Will Smith. What if he's like, I'm not here because I did anything. I'm here for you. And he just keeps performing Fresh Prince of Bel-Air over and, and over hear, and over for a loop bum, for eternity. Bum, 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 bum. What do you think Dr. Fauci did today? You think he just woke up and made more lies? I love how the weather app was like 40%. And then after that, it was like, nope. Yeah, you don't. They were like, yo, it's going to rain a little in New York. Except for Washington Square Park. It's going to pour directly on that bitch. Oh, she's dancing in the fountain? 
See? Wow. That's gentrification. Oh, boy. Big TikTok energy. Dude, we have to fucking talk to her. Yo. Anyone got an umbrella? Anyone got an umbrella? You know the vibes? It's raining, but we still out here. Fuck a rain delay. Yeah. yeah. What you doing? Um, this is something I do every day. Mm -hmm. This is something I just need. You know, like, it's like a basic necessity for living. Like we need sleep, we need eat. If you're a human being, like it's something like that. Like I need dance to just being alive. Is there any type of weather that you wouldn't dance in? If it's not too dangerous to live in, I, I, I'll do any kind. You would dance in a tornado? Like that. I mean, if the tornado is like it's small and maybe I'll be here and. Okay. If you get here, I just escape. Respect what you're doing. Keep doing your thing. Keep dancing. Best dancer watch this grand park. Give it right here. You already know. Right, be sure to hit up her Venmo. You know what I'm saying? About to come down again, goddamn. All right, we out here watch this grand park. Uh, unfortunately, hey. another torrential downpour has started. That's right. So we are going to get inside where it's safe. So we're getting wet, not in that good uh, way, but in a bad way. Yeah. We want to shout out our special guest, my guy Andrew, our third correspondent. Those are the good Hard questions. Hard-hitting questions. You see me? I'm being left hanging right now. You guys saw that? Oh, Anyways, my fault, my fault. it's raining. We got to get the hell out of here. That's, That's right. right. Shout out to my guys for having me on. Yes, sir. Listen, we're getting back to our non-creepy white van with no windows. We'll talk to you later. We got red candy on the side. Holla. We out. Welcome to the Jesus and Mero YouTube channel. That's right, you know what I'm saying? Like, subscribe, you know what I mean? That's right, we got a lot of digital content right here to keep you up in between our shows. So be sure to like, subscribe, and you know, click watch another video. We out. Hit all the players, watch man videos, holla.